Hey guys, and welcome back to the start of a new series. Now, this is going to be a um, another custom club series. Unfortunately, I did I did notify you guys that I was sacked as manager of YouTube FC, which was our last custom club series on Football Manager 2020 Mobile. So now uh, I made a poll just a couple of days ago, uh, basically asking you guys for your uh, to fill in a form if you guys want to be in the series and you guys have done just that so brilliant and now we have all the players so we're going to start off by i'm going to sh be showing you guys the tactics we have so far this is again uh, this is a brand new team we've never seen them play before we've got a lot a lot of youngsters so uh there's no there's no certain way about going with this uh with with the tactics for this team we're just gonna have to basically go um, go along as we play match for match so fortunately we do have some friendlies and i would say it's also a good uh it's good that we've got some tough opponents we've got psg tottenham and marseille in the friendly so that's really going to test us and see how we cope but the team looks good though um so let's go for the players and by the way we can do squad numbers Thing. I'm just gonna have to auto pick guys because it's really long and obviously not all of you guys have notified me of your um notified me of your preferred squad numbers so that's our squad numbers done so let's go from the top so we got max chambers english goalkeeper 17 years old uh see now here's the thing you guys have told me to put you as three and a half stars stars uh current or four stars current potential and obviously five stars Sorry, not current potential. Current ability, uh, three and a half or four stars, and potential five stars. But the thing is, with with you guys being so young, it doesn't doesn't put you straight from the start as a three and a half or four current ability. We've got a great example here. We've got Max Chambers. He's only two star ability, but he's got some uh, some some good attributes, and he's surely gonna really grow in value over the over the season hopefully we don't get sacked again all right so we've got max chambers our first keeper next we got nick ger uh 20 year old nigerian he's free star potential again same thing i tried putting him as a three and a half or however you guys requested his value is 57 million though so that's really good for a young star he's got also good pace stamina and very good strength uh some good aerial crossing and dribbling's not that bad so yeah that's our first right back then we got mike literis and i can't help but um point out the fact that some of you guys have put some silly names on here to make it you know i don't know what you call them but basically when you like it's like a dirty name or a dirty word and you put it into a name and it kind of sounds wrong i'm not gonna exactly say what i'm referring to when it comes to this name but i'm sorry if this is your real names or whatever but i'm just saying it will sound weird if i say it all together and it might sound a bit wrong so i'm gonna take my time and say them very slowly and separately so we've got mike literis 23 year old uh two and a half star potential fullback from england we got a uh, german German player, Jakob Schell. Schill. I'm not, sorry, I don't know how you say it. Again, sorry for the pronunciation, guys. Uh, this is a multilingual <laughs> squad we have here. Literally names from every every continent. 25-year-old fullback, but he's also a centre-back. One-star potential. Uh, sorry, one-star... One star ability. Next, we got myself, Crispy Chris. Oh, I just couldn't. Why am I 19 years old? I put myself at 20 years old. What the hell? I don't understand this game. I want to say sometimes it's a bit buggy, or I'm not sure why. Anyway, and by the way, the, the name of the team is London FC. If you guys haven't haven't noticed, or if I didn't make it clear, but obviously it'll be in the video title. So we got Mark Ellis, uh, defensive winger. Not sure why he's a defensive winger. I clearly put him as a central midfielder. Anyway, 
58 million value, 16 years old, three star uh, current ability, which is good. Then we've got Navodka, Slovakia, 19 years old, uh, central midfielder. Here we got Jesse Camby, uh, Kenyan, international, inside forward. We've got Jonathan Morency, uh, inside forward again, 16 years old from Haiti, Haiti, or we'll just say Haitian. Got Nico Bro Bobrovic, Croatian, 19 years old, advanced playmaker. Then we got Sachin Kumar, inside forward. Uh, probably going to put him on the wing, not sure why he's on a uh, striker. But yeah, of course, uh, a lot of you guys have requested uh, you guys to be uh, multi position players. So obviously, that's why uh, uh, Sachin could also play striker. Here we got keeper Luis De Leon. Guatemalan, 16 years old. Got Alonso, Brandon Alonso, American. Not sure why the current ability is so low. It's literally half a star, really bad. But obviously, the stats are going to improve over time. Again, uh, then we got Big Boy. This is literally the name that I was I was sent on the comments. And also, I wasn't given a specific nationality, so I just put him as Brazilian. Um... Yeah, he is inside forward as well. We got John Gonçalves. I think we had this player in our last series as well for YouTube FC. Uh, he's a fullback, 17 years old. We got Seymour Teets, 19 years old, uh, from Ghana, defensive midfielder. We got Sam Stewart, 16 year old Scottish player, mid uh, central midfield. We got G Med. 20-year-old Algerian inside forward, very good value. Here we got Dylan Hemingway, 18-year-old English inside forward. And here we got a striker from Turkey, Sabahattin Torkoglu, 20-year-old Turkish international. Here we got Hunaid Blitz, 4.8 million. He is from England, 22-year-old. We got Billy Hannant, another center back from england uh, here we got georgie mcleds uh 16 year old spanish inside forward again got a fellow greek international barba barba georges pericles 15 years old I'm not sure why i put 16 but again this is the game Another advanced playmaker, then we got uh, Adrian Grindberg, uh, inside forward, 16.75 million value and 15 years old, inside forward again. And we got Frankie Lundberg, Lundberg, that's how you say it, 18 years old, from Finland. So that's the squad introduction, guys. Now let's head over to the tactics. So we're going to be playing balance just because I don't want to go, I usually tend to go control, but because we've got a quite a lot of youngsters, it might, it might be, we might have to balance it out between counter and balance because I don't know if we can fully go attacking right now with not, the players not really used to how they play as a team and stuff. The defensive lineup will be balanced. The closing down, which will be in our own half. We don't want to exhaust our players and we don't want to leave too many gaps where we're trying to mark all over the pitch. The tackling will remain normal just so we don't commit too many bad fouls and get reds. And we're going to do a bit of time wasting, which I mean, who doesn't as a team? When the, the result is in their favour and they want to kill the game off. In the final third, we're going to be looking for overlap, working to box and through balls. Again, these are just my de my default uh, tactics. Obviously, we're going to change that as we go along. Obviously, I'll be listening to your recommendations. And we've got the passing style, which we mixed. That might change as well. We'll see if uh, it's not working well. And then the passing focus is also mixed. And we've got short goalkeeper distribution. Penalty takers, we've got... Uh, Kumar, Tokoglu, myself, Kambi and Morency. Free kick takers, Kambi, Kumar, Tokoglu and Hamani. Corner takers, Med, G, Ellis, Kambi. And the captain, we're going to do that right now. Who's going to be the captain? Oof. Who's this goalkeeper? Probably going to do... Probably... We're going to do Mike Litteris. 
Then we're going to put Mark Ellis, then Sachin, and then we've got another, another player. Let's put, let's put Honide Blitz. All right, guys. So, all right. So the London FC directors expect the club to achieve European success in a ta uh, safe mid-table position. Um. Uh, yeah, let's just say we're going to be going for a mid-table league position. So let's see the report. We got assistant manager, defensive, youth, goalkeeping. Let's do a coaching exam. Okay, he failed. Let's put another invite. Uh, sorry, a vacant position. Put it out there for other managers to join as the coaches. And then uh, let's put some uh, scouts. And let's just do this one quickly. And he passed. So he's going to be a gold physio. All right. Oof. Got a lot of negatives. But again, this is a new squad. Suggested XI, Kumar, squad that. Club stats, all right. All right, so we've been recommended some players which would help in the long run, but of course we're not going to be really delving into that. As we want to stick to the players that are in the series so let's head over to the PSG match about it's about 14 days away prevention prevention yeah let's 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 get the Chelsea one oh wait, wait, wait. No, no 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 let's just get this one we want to get prevention and here we get another youth Fitness, fitness, fitness. We need someone who's general, so let's go on staff again and put another position available. <clears throat> Got bargain hunter, youth scout, youth scout. Let's put let's put a bargain hunter. Why not? Again, it's just we need to find another staff here ASAP. All right, please don't tell me it's all fitness again. Ah, oh, my days. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Let's let's do a staff search, customize, staff role, coach, specialism. Let's do it uh, general. New aptitudes, natural. Gold. Hold on, where's the minimum badge? Gold. Alright, so apparently there's none. <sighs> Any... Staff role. Coach. Let's just get, let's get an attacking coach, why not? Okay. So let's put someone who's interested. All right. So we got that out of the way. Sorry for the long wait. But now we are ready to head into our first match of this episode. Again, it's, uh, it's going to be a bit of a boring episode. It's mostly of an introduction, so... I'll be able to fit in this PSG game and the game after that. 
So let's see how it's how we how we, how we can handle this because we've got a long young a lot of young players, so it'll be really hard. And we've never literally never actually played a professional game before. So let's see who we got here. Um, we got Mike on the left wing back. Let's put Med for Morency. Talent. De Leon. Just looking at everyone's value and can be Med Bobovic. Oh, let's put the all right let's just leave it like this for now and we're gonna obviously obviously be experimenting so let's just straight into it here we get mbappe And damn. So yeah, I basically fucked up. I didn't put the enhanced match engine. Great. All right, we're just gonna have to keep it going, and we're gonna have to keep it going with this uh, match engine right now. It's this is the normal one. Can't even fuck that up, but. The only reason why I wouldn't do it again because that means I need to make the club again. I need to put everyone's names in again, and that took that took a, a long time. There was about 20, 27 names I had to put in. All right, we're losing two 0 already to PSG. It's uh, no surprise, honestly. Cavani makes it three 0 We're talking about a world class team coming up against a newly created club with obviously some good prospects, but. Nowhere near the experience needed to compete at this level. Neymar misses a free kick. Here's Mbappe and he scores another goal. That's 4 0 now. Oh, this can be a bit greedy there. Again, Mbappe. See the difference in quality. We couldn't even get that shot on target that we just had the highlight of. And then let's put this on. Put this on medium. Is Munier. Good save from Delion. It can be. Is it going to be our first goal? No, it isn't. It's Brobovic. Unlucky though, it was a decent chance. It's Mbappe, and it's a good save. Marco Verratti, that goes off. All right, guys, so we uh, break in our first game, first professional game uh, with a 5 0 loss to PSG. So that's a bit of a humil humiliation, but hopefully that sparks a reaction from the players for the next game. Alright, so this time, let's change this one up a bit. Let's bring on um, Deep Line Playmaker. Let's bring in Adrian Grimberg for Camby. Uh, let's bring in Lundberg for the Turkish striker. 
Bring in a vodka for Stuart. Uh, Gonzalez for Nick. Myself for Alonso. Let's bring in Seymour Teets for Alice. All right, guys. Let's just straight into it. See how we get on with this one. All right, already an injury. So let's put on Morency on the wing. All right, here's Sachin Kumar with a first decent chance of the game, but it does just go out and it's a goal kick. Or Kane with a decent chance there. Here's again in Dombele to Kane, and it is going to hit the crossbar though. We're just about, we're just about hanging in there. Referee's going to give a yellow card to one of our players, and it's a free kick for Tottenham. Another free kick for Tottenham. Oh, another chance. Okay. Another yellow, but this time it's going to be for Tottenham. So we get a free kick, and here's Teets to Limburg, and it's 1 0 for London FC, guys. What a result we have on our hands. All right, guys. So half time, uh, we've actually been doing very well compared to that game against uh, PSG. So let's keep it going. The stats are in our not not really in our favor, but we're not too far apart in terms of possession or just shots in general. Here is a penalty for Tottenham. It's Shields second yellow card, so that's not good. Let's bring on. Um, who else we got? Let's bring on myself. So Bobovic is gonna have to make way, unfortunately. So unfortunately, that's Bob Bobovic's game done, and Kane does score to make it 1-1, and even if we do take a draw away from this, it would still be a very decent result. Is Lucas Moura, and it does go out, out for a uh, goal kick, and that is the final whistle of the game, guys. 1-1. We certainly played way better in this uh, in this game than the last one, so certainly we're improving somewhat. But let's uh, since we got this normal match engine, these games are flying by much much quicker. So let's see what where we can go with a game against Marseille in about five days. All right, guys. So we got Marcel today. Let's see who we got. I think I'm going to bring on... Let's bring on Georgie. Okay, we'll keep him as a winger. And... <clears throat> bring on Ellis from the vodka. And let's get straight into it. Here's Payet for Marcel with a first chance to get the lead. But it does go over and not for long though. Marcel make it 1-0. I'm going to make this one a bit more slow. Very fast, fast, medium, slow. Uh, 
All right, guys. So uh, if you look at the stats, it's not that bad. I mean, we have this literally identical shots. A bit less possession, but let's see if we can improve in this second half. Another free kick, and uh, let's make some changes. Let's change up the whole squad to see if uh, we can make a change late on. Bring on Morency for Mike, then Mel, Med G for Kumar, Novotka, Matiz, Stewart for Ellis, Nick for Gonzalez, myself for Alonso. And big boy for Bobrovich. And I think that will be the end of the game. All right, guys, so that's our second uh, defeat in three games. And, yeah, I mean, it was only 1-0. We didn't play too bad. And also, it's really annoying me that we're not on the enhanced match engine. I thought that would be set as default. But it seems not. But anyway, we got our first game at home to Manchester United and then a game after that away to Arsenal. Tough two tough opening games that we're going to be having in this uh, in our first season in the Premier League but it's going to be an interesting ride and I look forward to seeing you seeing it with you guys and I hope you guys uh, stick in stick along and hopefully we can do some great things with this club and uh, with you guys as players so until the next episode guys take it easy